guys. Hello, hello, hello. Okay, so I wanted to talk to you guys real quick. I wanted to go over and review the last EVP we did. Um, I needed to take a break first um, today. I need to get my energy back. I need to clean my house. I need to clean my spirit and my soul. I need to clean everything after all that. Um, so after, since I've done the um, Kobe Bryant reading, um, a lot of weird things have been going on here. Not too crazy. Um, I keep seeing 1111, and Hubby keeps seeing 1111. Yesterday I saw it, I meant today I saw it twice. Last night I saw it at 111. It was 1 in the morning, 111. Um, I was telling my mom about it, and as I was telling her about it, I looked up, and, sorry, and um, on the clock it said 111. I looked at the other clock, it said 111. I was like, see, Mom? Um, the other day, the day before that, I saw it once. It was, um, I think it was, what number was it? I think it was like 12-12. Yeah, uh, that same day, Hubby saw 11-11. Um, usually when people see numbers like that, it's their spirit trying to tell them something. There is a message that has to get through. Um, so that was really creepy. So that night, yet yeah, last night, like I said, it was like 1 in the morning. Yes, baby, are you Okay. Okay, so um, last night we we were getting ready for bed and my phone rang so I, I looked at it and hubby was calling me. So I was like, babe, why are you calling me? He was like, I'm not calling you. So I showed him, look, you called me and I declined the, the, the call because, you know, you're sitting right there. I thought you was, he was playing with me because I told him to change the baby's pamper. So I thought he was calling me to be like, yo, change the baby's pamper. But... He didn't, so when he showed me his phone, he was getting his phone, and all of a sudden, his phone was dialing me again. So that was really just different. It was odd. We both just looked at each other like, okay, you know, time for bed. <laughs> so with that being said, after all that, you know, there's just a lot on my heart and my mind, and I just wanted to put it out there so that you guys, you know, you guys know what I'm feeling going through. Yes, baby? Are you all right? <laughs> so, Australia is on fire. This is just stuff that I know off the top of my head, okay? Australia is on fire. The Amazon is on fire. Hawaii had the volcano eruption. Puerto Rico, now remember this one, okay? Because I'm going to come back to this. Puerto Rico had the earthquake, okay? A couple of them, a whole swarm of them, in fact. Um, Italy was devastated by the earthquake last year. Um, Somalia was declared a state, uh, or state, I don't know what it is, a state, a country, I think it's in South Africa, but whatever that is, Somalia is, you know, they're in, like, it, they're calling it the locust plague, okay, and they're scared that it's gonna get out and go to other countries and eat all the food, so that could be devastating. Um, China is going on with this coronavirus, and... Speaking of the coronavirus, you know, they, they said they contained it within the first two weeks. So how is it in all the, these other countries? You know what I'm saying? I feel like it was planted. Um, the Bahamas now had an earthquake, a really big one. So Puerto Rico and the Bahamas. It, I'm sorry, I didn't mean to have you guys looking at a blank screen. Um, <clears throat> Puerto Rico and the Bahamas. If you put your, your right hand into a shape of a C with your pointer and your thumb only okay we're gonna have the point of your your thumb as the Bahamas I mean as Puerto Rico if you close your fingers together that middle part of the sea would be um, the Bahamas now at the tip of your finger and your pointer finger that would be the Gulf of Mexico and what's on the Gulf of Mexico is the um, Madrid fault line now when Puerto Rico had its first earthquake it was a seven point something it was really big um, they said there was also one um, on the other side of Puerto Rico, but in the in the waters where the tectonic plates are, okay? They say they're shifting. So if they're shifting and then all of a sudden Bahamas got it, boom, boom, you know, um, what's next would be <clears throat> the Gulf of Mexico's. And when that goes, the Madrid's going to go, okay? And that could be devastating. That could split us in half, the whole United States, okay? Um, man, I, I have so many, like, visions I'm seeing just chaos it, it, it's and I have <sighs> okay don't come for me okay 
This is just my opinion. Okay? Don't come for me. I feel like if they kick Trump, I'm not I'm not supporting nobody, okay? All I'm saying is if they kick Trump out of office, I feel like shit's going to hit the fan even faster. Okay? That's just my opinion. Um, but I'm seeing martial law. I'm seeing concentration camps. I'm seeing the military just coming in your house and killing everybody. I'm seeing straight chaos, and the part that scares me the most is, is it's our own people. It's our own military. It's not foreigners. It's our own military. So I'm, like, freaking out, you know? That was a I, Man, I feel like they... <laughs> between the last two days, ever since I did that first EVP, it's like... There was just so many spirits around me. I don't know if it's all the ones from the plane. I meant from the helicopter. I don't know. But I am being overloaded with information. And I, I'm i trying to put it out there the best I can and as respectfully as I can. Um, but I'm, I'm seeing some shit. Sh sh shit about to hit the fan. And I don't know. I just wanted to let y'all know that. Mm -hmm. Um, I did want to get deeper into it, but I'm not because it's a touchy subject and I don't want to put nobody's panties in a bunch. You all right? Yeah. So, yeah, I, I was cleaning. I'm literally scrubbing every room and I'm just giving it a new fresh energy. I'm trying to do that for myself as well. You know, I took a nice shower. I'm going to take another shower and, and just really, what are you doing? Can you stop? Don't, don't do that. She's, she's, she forces herself to do that. What are you doing? Watch. See? Watch. What are you doing? Really? <laughs> um, so, yeah. Really? Let me go over there to her. Ugh. What are you doing? So, I don't know. It's just a lot. So, I'm just trying to... I have to let you guys know it, first of all, because I don't think they're going to stop until I tell you. Catalina, take your bobo. Stop that. Oh, hold on. Take a bobo. Mm-hmm. Uh-uh, I'm not holding you. Don't let go. Don't let go. Um, but, yeah, I'm just really trying to... Get, get my energy back. I couldn't get my energy back until I told you guys about everything that I'm getting. Um, I didn't get, get give every detail because, you know, I don't want to hurt nobody's feelings and, you know, whatever. But I, I told you the main parts. Um, and maybe they'll, they'll let me rest now. And I just want to clean everything. That's what I feel like I have to do. I just got to clean everything and give every room a, a new fresh vibe and you know so if you're going through like hard times and stuff try that okay um just clean up you know like a deep clean you know with some bleach and all that stuff you know clean up real good take a shower but not just a shower not just any shower a spiritual shower it's when you just wash all them vibes away you know what i'm saying let me plug my phone up so, yeah, that's what I'm doing. I love you, babes. And I will be doing a reading tomorrow. I don't know if I'm going to be doing Kobe Bryant, though, because I know they have a lot to say. But trust me, I'm hearing them. <laughs> oh, my. So, yeah, um, I think this is all a lot deeper than we think. Um, if I that's an understatement. It really is. Um, but, yeah, let me see. Uh, let me see. Hold on. Let me see something. Uh, pause. Okay, well, I can't find it, but anyways, um, I love y'all.